So Abby, what were you up to this weekend? Well, Jackie, I was lucky to have a very fun weekend. Yep. I was in Chicago with my mom and my sister. We were having a little bit of a belated birthday celebration for me. And so we just went out. We were window shopping. Unfortunately, didn't find anything, but I'm sure Shucks. our viewers know that feeling. When you're out, you're looking for something. You don't quite find it, but you still have fun just walking around. And I had a really great meal, too. I went to a Chinese restaurant, and I had dim sum, one of my favorites. And I just think of that as is the meal that I dream about. Mm -hmm. I have lots of foods that I mm -hmm. dream about, but that is one of them. Mm -hmm. So I'm wondering, let us know on our Facebook if you have any any meals that you dream about that you think this is the meal that I would want to have as my last meal every meal every time of the day. So I don't know. I'm still thinking about that right All now. Day, every but, day. <laughs> well, let's take a look at what our team was also up to this weekend. We did. Greg said, I tried my hand at making Detroit style deep dish pizza mm. on Saturday. I also stopped by the community Knitathon on Saturday at the Well and the Near Northwest Neighborhood Arts Cafe on Sunday. That's what Greg was up to. And Dorian said that he kicked off the spooky season by taking his family to the theater to see a haunting in Venice. It was a great way to start October. Overall, it wasn't too scary and I am glad to hear that because I'm not into the scary movies. <laughs> Kennedy went to a private screening at St. Mary's of an unreleased film and got to meet the director, Christine Swanson. Visited her baby nephew, Zaylin, caught up with some old friends on FaceTime and ordered in some Olive Garden. It's oh, a great yum. weekend. Love the breadsticks. And Jesse said that all he did was watch football and rugby, and that's a classic Jesse short answer.